President Truman, we need a decision. Do we drop the bomb? Make the call. Make the call. Okay, people, this is it. We've been building to this for four years. So let's give it all we've got. Let's make a show. Let's make the Harry S. Truman Show. This episode of the Harry S. Truman Show brought to you by the Broadway musical Taft Punk. International sensation. Uh, August 6, 1945. The day my baby's finally going to be born. Taft Punk. And now back to the Harry S. Truman Show. Morning, Stimson. Morning, Truman. How is everything this morning? Peachy Keen, Mr. President. Quite excellent. Yes, yes. How about the agenda? First off, Mr. President, just wanted to check. You had your dark roasted Colombian bean coffee this morning? What's it to you, pal? I just know how you love your nice Colombian roasted coffee before you face each day. Well, while it does bother me that you've asked me that question every morning for the last four mornings, and I've given you the same answer, Fess always makes my coffee at the top of the morning. I wake up to the fresh, delightful smell of a delicious dark Colombian bean roast. Well, we can check that off. Yeah, you need to settle on some colors for this. I don't have time for this. I've told you a thousand times. That's why we brought in someone to help you. Morning, Mr. President. I'm Alan West, door to door salesman. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. All right, Mr. President, let's see what we can do about your paint issue. Let's. Right here, I've got some of the more popular colors among uh, other world leaders. Why don't you have a look? Dull, 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 dull. I need something that'll brighten this place up, Alan. Look, I've got the perfect thing for you, Mr. President. Look at this right here. This has to be the perfect color for this office. It's perfect. Okay, they're wrapping this up. Let's get ready for the reveal. It's been an honor, Mr. President. We'll have some painters in here tomorrow. Thank you for your help, Alan West, and thank you for your service to this country. You betcha. Oh, and there's one more thing. I'm your long lost brother. It's beautiful. Presidents don't shake hands, brother. Presidents hug. Ah! Brilliant. Mr. President. Yes, Stimson. It's Colonel Tibbets. Not Tibbets. Yes. He needs to know if little boy is ready to meet his Japanese host family. We need a final answer. I wanted to commence the attack. Maybe I should leave. No, Alan. I'd like you to stay here. I need you here for this. I want to make you proud. You know, you could only make me more proud if you drop that damn bomb on Japan. Mr. President. Yes, Stimson. Okay, people. Gather around. This is the most important moment of your time in office. This is the most important moment in the history of this show. No matter what you choose to do this day, you're already in the history books. It's this one decision that will polish or tarnish you forever. No matter what he chooses this day, our record will be secure in Reagan's history. But what happens next will determine whether we go on for another season or are canceled immediately. So, sir, with a heavy heart, make this decision. So, everyone, with a steady hand, let's make these last shots great. President Truman, we need a decision. Do we drop the bomb? Make the call. Make the call. It's like my father said, you can't take the radiation, build a democratic nation. Let's do it.
I'll make the call. Okay, people, he's made the call. We're about to take a step no show has ever taken before, and hopefully never will again. We're about to bomb a foreign country for ratings. May God, God have mercy on our souls. Roar! Roar! Roar!